All right, this is pre-calc uh, topic eight, practice assessment. We're doing the second problem on it. Um, we're supposed to find a polynomial that has those zeros. And if you'll notice, I, I already have two of them, uh, two zeros listed, the four and the, the three minus two i. Remember, these will come in conjugate pairs. So if three minus two i, if three minus two i is one of the um, zeros, then three plus two i must be one of the zeros as well. So three plus two i, is implied, it comes in with a three minus uh, 2i. So I have uh, x minus four, x minus this, so three plus 2i, and x minus this, so three minus 2i. I'm subtracting the whole thing. Now, if you wanted, you could do the sum pairwise and product and get it this way. Uh, I'm gonna multiply it out. So I'm gonna multiply these two together first and then worry about that. So let's see, x times x is x squared. x times negative 3 is negative 3x. x times negative 2i is negative 2xi. And, uh, you know, I think I'll just change color just so we don't lose track of stuff. I'm going to distribute this negative 3 now. Negative 3 times x is negative 3x. Negative 3 times negative 3 is positive 9. <clears throat> and then negative 3 times negative 2i, a negative times a negative is positive. So that's positive 6i. Uh, and let me do this third one. I'm going to distribute that 2i to everything. So 2i times x, that is positive 2xi. 2i times negative 3, that is negative, negative times positive, 6i. And then 2i times negative 2i. Let's see, uh, negative 2 times 2 is negative 4. i times i is i squared. And the thing I know about this is i squared is negative 1. So this whole thing is a positive 4. All right. So then let's uh, go ahead and combine up some like terms with this one. I've got my x squared. I've got negative 6x. This cancels out to a 0. This cancels out to a 0. And then I have 9 plus 4 is 13. All right. So, so far, so good. And then I have that multiplied by x minus 4. And let me start to distribute this out. x times x squared is x cubed. Negative 6x squared plus 13x. Distribute this negative 4. Negative 4x squared. Negative times a negative is positive. Positive 24x. And then negative 4 times 13 is uh, negative 52. Add these together. x cubed minus 10x squared plus 37x minus 52, and there's my polynomial that would have those zeros.